Writer. P.H. Um, my name is Roger Field. I'm the president of Live Nation Asia Pacific and I'm delighted to be here with you, not only in Manila, but in person, all gathered to celebrate this auspicious occasion because we haven't been able to do this for so long. I've got a, a group of colleagues down there I haven't seen for two and a half years and I'm sure that's been the same for many of us, so this is indeed a great day. Um, I, I haven't performed in the round before, so apologies to those uh, behind me. Um, please don't ask for a refund, I'll do my best. <laughs> So today we officially announced the acquisition of Music Management International, as we know in the mind. Uh, Risa Pasqua, I'm very excited, is appropriately appointed as the Managing Director of Live Nation Philippines. This is a very, very proud moment for Live Nation. We have we've a long-standing successful relationship with Risa and MMI, and the launch of Live Nation Philippines is the logical next step in our commitment to grow the Asia Pacific region. As the world's leading live entertainment company, Live Nation is privileged to work with artists to bring their creativity to life on stages around the world, including now in the Philippines. Whether it's two, 200 people in a small packed out club, or whether, as I saw in uh, Las Vegas last week, tens of thousands of people at a BTS show in the stadium, or at one of our festivals with a packed lineup of artists, a live show does more than entertainment. Live entertainment can uplift, it can inspire, and most importantly, live entertainment creates lifelong memories and lifelong friends. Live Nation is at the very heart of entertainment globally. We produce more concerts and we sell more tickets and connect more brands with music than anyone else in the world. We are supremely fitted out to do that. I'll give, you some, uh, I'll give you some boring stats, but they're important and they're stats we're really proud of. Across the world, we bring 40,000 shows, more than 110 festivals to life each year. We own and operate more than 270 venues. That's a huge priority for our business and more venues in this region is our absolute focus. So breaking it down, this means 5,000 touring artists selling 98 million tickets and, uh, sorry, 98 million fans and about 500 million tickets, it's half a billion. So those are pretty, pretty juicy numbers there. Ooh. Artists, though, are at the core of our business, and the shows we produce allow them to directly connect with their fans in the most powerful way. Live music is one of the most powerful way to connect with new audiences and for our fans to connect with each other as well. Particularly, we're dedicated to growing local artists and particularly in Asia, we want to do a lot more than that. And we've demonstrated that recently by launching our Ones to Watch Discovery brand, which has already seen artists in China, like, uh, China, New Zealand and Australia find new fans across the world, and we're bringing that to more markets as we go. We also have a full service sponsorship team that connects global and local brand partners um, when the fans are truly listening and truly engaged at our shows. And that's a unique proposition. We have more than 1,000 brand partners across the globe. Um, some of you will have uh, already met James. Um, he's gladly here. He'll be the only person conspicuously wearing a red mask. And he's looking forward to making a lot of new friends. But already in Asia, our partners include Pepsi, Budweiser, Mercedes, Toyota, Samsung, and Marriott Hotels. And uh, as I said, we hope to work with a number of new leading and more leading brands across the nation and some of you are here today, so thank you very much for coming. As you can imagine, this is a massive undertaking, everything we do, and I certainly can't do it alone, and none of us can do it alone. There's 44,000 hardworking, dedicated employees in our organisation worldwide. And tonight, we're thrilled and honoured to be welcoming Reza and her team into that family, um, and they'd be very welcome additions. Yeah, Live Nation Philippines adds another important chapter in our story of delivering exceptional live entertainment experiences to more fans and more opportunities for artists to grow their audiences globally. Reza is a formidable operator. Um, it's not only you in this room that know how formidable she is, She's highly regarded overseas uh, for what she's done in putting the Philippines on the map globally. 
and I think we can tell she sure knows how to put a show on. <laughs> great, great evening, great production. You're making me look great, Reza, thank you. <laughs> the live experience that we all know and love and have sorely missed is coming back strong, and we remain very, very confident, not only in its full return, but it's going to be bigger and better than ever. The next couple of years is going to be huge. There's a strong supply and there's huge demand. So with so many shows and events that we're already doing elsewhere in the world, we're seeing that fans are more eager than ever to get back to live. And we've got a huge, huge pipeline of content to come. So it's going to be big and the time for Live Nation Philippines to be launched could not be better as the world reopens. And one thing we've seen through this period is although we've all tried to meet with friends over Zoom and we've tried to enjoy music, nothing beats the experience of live and connecting with the same people in the same moment, in the same room. There's nowhere else that people can get together for two hours of magic. So we're very proud of our proposition and the fact we'll get back to that. And there's no better partner in the Philippines or anywhere for Live Nation than Reza and the MMI team. So together we're dedicated to bringing the biggest artists and the biggest opportunities to the Philippines. And stay tuned for some major announcements in the coming months. So, so